congratulations on your on your college debut. I know you probably would have liked to have it end better, but just take me through it. You know, two plays in, you fumble, but come back and but you spark an offense to to get it back in the game. So how would you kind of sum this up? Yeah, I mean. Came in, coach called him a number. Came in, I was a little nervous. I didn't think I was, but I guess my body was. And coughed it up, coach Bull got on me. Whatever, got that out of the way. Came back in halftime, made some adjustments. Coach called on my number again, said we're gonna do this. Went out there and did my best. Um, did what the coaches asked of me to the fullest that I can. And came up a little short, but we'll be all right. Did you, did you expect that you would play in this game? Or when they called your number in that first half, was that a case of No, I mean, we game plan throughout the week, and I knew sometime at this game my number would be called. And so when he called in, I tried to do what I can do and do the best I can. What allowed you to have so much success running the ball against the front? You know, just a lot of film this week. Um, Certain looks we run into. um, Just wanted to run into the right looks. You know, if it's not the right look, get out of it, change the play. But, I mean, a lot of film, a lot of preparation, a lot of practice. You know, right now, I mean, I'm okay with them here and there. Some stuff is a little fuzzy. Some stuff's okay. Um, we'll progress forward. We'll learn more. Um, watch the tape. See what we can do better. Um, we can just get better off of this. I mean, that's all we can do. Were you disappointed or surprised that you weren't in there in the last series? No, you know, you know, it's coach's coach's deal. I mean. I would love to be in there, but Coach has a plan, and I believe in them, and I can trust in Coach Vegan and Coach Bull, and I know they have a plan for this team, and that was the best option to win the football game, and I'm a team guy first, and so that's what I, that's what I was okay with. To have, to have that kind of confidence in your <coughs> success in your opener, I should say, what, what does that do for your, your confidence and, and getting your feet wet? You know, just trying to boost it up a little by little. I mean, my confidence is a first-year guy, first time playing, so it's a little down there right now, but just – Little by little, chunk by chunk, boost my confidence. So the rest of the team has this confidence and we'll play at a high level and know we can compete with anybody in the nation. How many, how many times did you work with the actual offense during the week and how much was on the scouts for? I mean, how comfortable? Oh, you know, um, I've both and both. I mean, I do scouts and do the um, one offense. Um, just get reps. Just our defense is good. I mean, so if I'm out the scouts, then I can go against a really good defense and try to do my best. And I mean, do what I do, um, but as a scout, that's when I just really per, um, refine my craft and perfect it and make sure I got everything right and everything perfect. Going up, going up against y'all's defense every day in practice, how much do you think that prepared you? I think that prepared me quite a bit. That's a good defense in there. They played lights out today. I mean, the scoreboard didn't show that, but they played awesome, and that's a good defense. And going up against them is one of the best things that, I, that they can do for me. I mean, they can toughen me up by hitting me, you know, get me ready for a game, get me ready with a game-like speed, so... Your approach moving forward. Moving forward, I mean, I just do what they ask me to do. Um, do my do to the best of my ability. Get some reps here and there. If they ask me to go to scout, go to scout. Do what they ask me to do. I'm a team guy. They have a good plan. They're smart coaches. They're they're doing what the, uh, they can do. And so that's about it. Yeah. You, you got four games that you can play on. Burn your red shirt. Obviously, there's four more. So you played all of them. You burn it. Are you comfortable with that? If they call on. You? I'm a team guy. I mean, if I have to burn my red shirt to make us bowl eligible, I'm all for it. You know, Wyoming is a really big football state. And a lot of Wyoming fans like football, and they would like to see us in a bowl. So if I have to do that, then I have to do that. So I'm okay with it. Sean, how did you refocus after fumbling the second play to continue to have success? <clears throat> you know, I just blocked it out. Uh, other guys just said block it out. It, it happens to everybody. I mean, Tom Brady fumbles all the time. I mean, it happens. So just blocked it out. Cleared it out of my head, went back out there, and just forgot all about it and just played the game of football. Just the game I love, so that's about it.